Okay, YouTube family. So today's video is going to be coming to you straight from Larry's enclosure. If you follow me, you know who Larry is. Larry is my Asian water monitor. And we're going to spend some time with Larry today. And I'm actually going to record. I normally don't bring a camera into his enclosure because he only typically likes me in here. But um, as he's matured, he's become a little bit more flexible to um, the camera. So we're going to go ahead and let you guys see me spend some time with him today. Um, as you can see, it's very hot in here. I'm in his domain, so I will be sweating this entire video. I actually like coming in here though after I work out. Um, it kind of gives me the feel of a sauna as well. So sometimes I'll just come in here and sit with him just to sweat, um, to really, you know, clean out the pores and the things that you would do normally in a sauna. It's hot in here. It's extremely hot in here. Like right now, the ambient temperature on the right side is 98 degrees, 50% humidity. And on the left side, 90 degrees, 72% humidity. So I'm in the Caribbean right now, right? So, but I enjoy that. So I am going to actually let you guys just let me see see me spend some time with him today. Uh, Larry and I, well, I like to spend time with Larry in the water. Um, I think we have, he bonds better in the water. Outside of the water, he does well, but he particularly likes to just be climbing around on the ground. And I do not like the nails of the Asian water monitor too much. So in the water, it's less of him trying to climb up on my legs and things like that and scratching me. Um, as you can see, because it's hot, I have to wear Let's close. Sometimes if I wasn't doing this video, I would literally come in here in a bathing suit or a bikini or something like that. So, you know, I can definitely have better control of the temperature for myself. But because I'm doing this video, um, I adjusted a little bit. So I do have something that has a little sleeve to it in case he attempts to just kind of hold on to me. He doesn't do it intentionally, but he has really big nails, you'll see. Um, but yeah, come spend some time with us. a little fun with him then he leaves me alone for a moment then he'll resurface and come back and want to spend some more time Asian water monitors really 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 love the one-on-one -on -one time like a puppy almost and Larry particularly likes to be rubbed as you see when I was holding him under his chin um, behind his arms like almost in his armpits I don't know why um, and he actually doesn't mind his tail to be rubbed so typically if I'm getting him out of one of his hiding places which we don't have hides in here for him he literally decided where his hiding places would be or I call them his comfort places because he's really not at that point or that stage where he actually hides not for me anyway um, so yeah but um, 
He is an amazing animal. Um, I tell anybody that water monitors are what's up um, for me. Uh, they are definitely the next thing, best thing for me to a bigger monitor or alligator, which I really want sometime in life. But yeah, so I come in here and we have a good time together. All right, say, say bye bye, peeps. Say bye bye, peeps. Yeah, so he's just an amazing animal, as you can see. We spend some time together. He's done with me for the day, I think, though. Okay, you're done. done peeps this video might only be a couple minutes long a few minutes long but I've literally been in this close enclosure probably about an hour and a half um, again I do love being in here whether I'm engaging with him or not but the cool thing is is that I can come in here get my nice little I call it spa treatment <laughs> and have the Great pleasure of playing with an Asian water monitor. I'm loving on him a little bit while I'm in here as well. Um, it sounds like he's ready to come back out again. Um, hopefully he doesn't come this way and knock my camera over. But yeah, so I've been here for a very long time. And as you can see, 100 degree ambient temps pretty much. But it helps you breathe really, really good. Um, I swear I wish... You guys can see that there's no smells in here, no odors in here. Like when, my husband was just very, very, very smart um, when he went about building this enclosure. Um, it's a comfortable place to be in um, other than the heat. And I can't say, you know, the heat is uncomfortable, but I couldn't do two hours in here. Um, like I said, I've been here for about an hour and a half and I am now done with it. Um, but yeah, so. For those of you who ask, that's a little brief video of me and Larry. Um, I wanted to get a better view of you guys so you can, I mean, for you guys so you can see him swimming around in it. Um, but the camera was really dark on that side because I didn't add any lighting to this video. You, the lighting is literally the lights from his LEDs, and of course, they're not down low in the pool. But I'll add a clip of a video of him swimming around in his pool um, that I probably actually can just pull from you off of his camera. Um, so I appreciate it. Uh, I hope you like it. Um, if you're thinking of getting an Asian water monitor, some of the things that I will say is one, you have to have the spades for it. They just like the retex water monitors grow really really fast by the time you have that little quarantine tank they're outgrown that and they really do love water so actually the water monitor can literally be underneath the water for like about 30 to 45 minutes i think 45 minutes um is the longest i ever seen him do it and breathe i remember the first time he did it i, I called kevin um at nerd um uh, like i said that's where he comes from and i was like oh my god he's been under the water for 30 plus minutes or whatever and he was like ma'am it's an asian water monitor <laughs> but that was something that he I, I never witnessed him do until I brought him into this enclosure. So it was the first time that I really saw him do that like that. So I was like, okay. But yeah, so he really loves being in his water, especially in the summer months. You'll see him in there even more in the winter months. Um, not that the, the temps are always maintained in here, but for whatever reason, in the winter months, I don't see him swimming as long as he does in the summer months. So um, 
he has everything he needs in here i feed him i don't feed my water monitor every day i feed him nice size meals probably every two days or let's say about three times a week or if i feel that um he may need to eat a fourth time i might give him a smaller feeding but i feed him everything or water monitor we eat and i literally go a lot of times to the asian market to get asian food for him um but i feed him out he loves salmon that's his favorite if right now i bought salmon and he i don't care if he's hungry or not larry is going to come out of the woodwork um he loves um small rodents uh he loves chicks he loves um chicken livers that's another favorite of his um, and what i normally do um, and asian water monitors don't eat vegetables they eat nothing but meat they're carnivores so um i just feed him to not overfeed him but enough that i know that he's completely full um you water monitors will overeat and that's not good you want to make sure that they stay healthy um so like i said my regimen is to give them nice give him a nice sides meal but he literally probably would eat again for another two days um also i don't normally handle him um right after he eats um so i probably like a day wouldn't come in here and handle him at all um probably the second day before he's going to eat again i will come in here and handle him but uh after he eats i like to just let him get his full basket so you know my biggest fear is anything rotten in his stomach so i like for him to completely start to digest his food um and then keep himself healthy and make sure he has the energy he needs to do all the playing that he does in here they do a lot of things like about sometimes just watching the camera and i'm like he is having a ball by himself right so yeah um i i, I just really enjoy this guy this guy he's a pretty cool kid but there you have it guys hope you enjoyed it peace